in February of 2005, we found out that we were expecting um, and expected everything to go smoothly and to have a normal pregnancy, which is what we were hoping for. My water broke and we rushed to the hospital and I OB put in an emergency cyclage. Not very hopeful um, that it was gonna do much, but they said that based on the research, this was the best that they could do. He was severely premature. His lungs were very underdeveloped. He actually cried for us. We were very excited to at least hear that. Everything seemed to be going way better than expected. And at seven days on July 31st, I got to hold him for the very, very first time. What we didn't know was that would be the last time I got to hold him. Jalen stayed in the NICU for about 27 days and he just did not make it because he was so premature. It was probably the hardest thing we've had to deal with in ever. You never think it could happen to you. You always think that it, it just won't happen. When I get pregnant, I'm gonna have a healthy baby. You see that babies are born prematurely all the time, but until you've experienced it, you don't understand the importance of groups such as the March of Dimes and the information they prepared. You, you never know once you get pregnant, you know, how that the course of that pregnancy is going to go. And to have a group there that is there to support you in the event that you need them is highly important. We have just been very blessed to have the two that we have here. And Jalen just taught us a lot and taught us how important it is to get the information out. The um, March of Dimes really focused on the, the family as a whole, and you had that support there. And so you really focused on not only the care of the, the babies, but also the care of the parents and the family members. I think everybody should be supporting the March of Dimes, regardless of your background, your doctors. I mean, even if you have, don't have any children. But, you know, the goal across the board is to make sure that we have happy, healthy babies born. And I believe that that's exactly what the March of Dimes is doing, to avoid any parents having to tell another story like we have.